When you are doing squat jumps, or more importantly, jump downs, which simulate the environment that you would be in when you are taking a step or running or jumping off of or falling into anything, our joints absorb that pressure. How do we offset that by drawing our core up to keep the load of our own body slamming into the floor as little as possible? I'm gonna use this box. I'm not gonna jump onto the box yet because I have performance anxiety and I will trip and fall. But what I am gonna do is jump off the box. And knowing that I'm going to jump from this level, 14 inches down into the floor, how can I reduce the amount of stress that is put on each of my joints from my hip to my knee to my ankle? I'm going to start by coughing. <clears throat> and notice where that cough goes, right? That is bracing for the fall. That cough typically goes straight down into the floor. Now I'm gonna to try to cough again <clears throat> and bring that cough up instead. So let's try, cough up. <clears throat> the really, really visceral way to think about this is actually holding your butthole in, okay? So if you take nothing else away from this video, hold in your butthole. Let's step onto the box. Now, cough, <clears throat> up. Now, imagine yourself landing on the floor. <clears throat> All right, let's try a squat jump off the box now. I'm gonna land and hold my butthole in. Are you ready? And we jump. <clears throat> that wasn't great, but I get another shot, right? The worst thing that happens is I topple over and I bruise my elbow. Oh well, we tried, right? So we're gonna jump off. <clears throat> much softer. When you're hopping off, this is a no rep. Stiff landing. Oh my gosh, I got a reverberation up into my head jostled, okay? And I don't need any of that in my life. Believe me, I've got enough problems. So I'm gonna jump off and do a soft squatted landing, like one of those bouncy houses at McDonald's when the good old days, we're gonna jump off and bounce into the landing, <clears throat> cough up, Hold in your butthole. <clears throat> Step on. <clears throat> Step on. <clears throat> Two more. <clears throat> Notice the hands. <clears throat> Good, you wanna go up before you go down. Now we'll do five squats and discuss. One, up, two, up, three, hold in your butthole, two, and one. Great job. The last 20 seconds, we'll talk about how many reps to do while tapping the box. Every moment that you decide to devote to exercise, devote it. Be there, decide in advance how many reps and how many exercises you are willing to perform. Maybe you have two minutes. That's five jump offs, okay? Pick a short surface, 12, 14, 16 inches, a box, jump off of it. Immediately following that, five regular squats. Immediately following that, you can even grab your phone and get back to your emails, that's 30 seconds, but tap the step as you go. We've already done about 20 reps. Why do we tap the step? We just work the glutes, now we're getting into the hip flexors, a little bit of proprioception. If you wanna really bonus yourself out, set your device down, raise your hands up, and get that waistline engaged in your step. All ab four, three sideline abs, two, and one. Done. Good job.